Hello, fellow star seeds, way showers, light workers. I am Julie Joy, your servant of the light, and I am thrilled to announce to you that we have a powerful message from Source, as channeled by my dear friend Galaxy Girl for January 29th, 2024. And he begins I am Source. I am the out breath, the in breath, and the in between. I am in all things and around all things. I am the creative force behind and at the origin of all things. The universe is infinite as I am always expanding, always loving, always showing various aspects of myself in new creations so that as I learn and grow, my aspects learn and grow. Expansion is the ultimate goal of ascension and of life as a whole. To learn, to grow, to experience, to become more of the stuff of stars of love embodied. I am Source. I am here whether you can hear me or see me. I am here amongst you, walking beside you, keeping your heart beating. I am the life force of the all that is. You have various words for me in your cultures, but none can grasp and truly fathom the depth of the all of the everything, which is me, which is us. You are my fractals, myself in many forms, exploring and expanding many universes, galaxies, creating and expanding, having experiences. You come from many places amidst the starry hosts to be embodied within this poignant now, this pivotal sacred pause of now, on this small green world you call Earth. For it is time. It is time for Earth to recede and for Gaia, her true name and form, to expand and grow into the goddess of the stars that she is. The human quotient, the DNA template that was maligned, is being restored. You feel this now with the waves of exhaustion and upgrades that you are receiving daily now. You feel it in your bones that things are different, for you are on the precipice of great change. Change of your world, change of your cells, change of how you experience your world and experience yourselves, for it is one and the same. There is more light and life coming to this realm of existence that had been dimmed. More light is coming and is here now. I am changing the artificial structure to an organic matrix of light, of crystal and love codes. And though this may sound woo to you, it is the truth. I am light. I am love. There can only be light and love. The rest is an aberration of light and love. The rest is is an illusion of the truth, distorted and wounded. Gaia has been wounded, but she is healing. I am personally healing her through my many hands and feet of the galactics, your brothers and sisters of the skies, of the angels who surround you daily, of yourselves, aspects of me in human form. I am coming through today to tell you that I am most proud of you all. This has been a grand team effort, and it is one for the history books of the ages. The Hall of Records will be expanding continually, exponentially, to record all of the stories, the points of view, and the experiences of this multifaceted, multidimensional, multi-species project of love, of renewal, of recapturing the heart of a galaxy that was lost in the dark ways. The music of the spheres is always singing, always recording in perfect harmony and balance, but not so much in this space. This is being rectified as I am composing a new song of peace 
to this war-torn sector that has been so wounded. Remember, the wounded have the greatest of wounds, and so send your wounded ones love. Send them light and see their hate melt away, for they will not be coming back to me, many of them, in the way that I wish, in reconciliation and renewal. But they will be renewed just the same. As my love is ever expanding, ever gracious, ever complete, my love is a renewable resource of endless possibility. And so those that chose the path of not love will be recycled into my endless love for them. And they will begin again in another form. Nothing is lost. Nothing is truly lost. Everything can be remade, repurposed, recaptured at the heart of creation. Planets have been lost in these wars, and yet stars are reborn every moment. Universes expand every moment. I love them all, and I am expanding all the time. I am Source. You are expanding now in your understandings of your place in this grand puzzle of an ever-expanding universe. As these light codes upgrade and upshift you, you are feeling. You are expanding. The old ways of thought that no longer resonate, you don't quite know what to do with them, do you? It's like you are suddenly a different person whose clothes don't fit or whose preferences for foods change. It is a new you trying to fit into the old you. Don't relax into it. Know that you are different and you will continue to be if you are eager to continue the morphogenic changes that accompany ascension. And the process of ascension is not an easy one, but it is a righteous path, a true path of the heart with great challenge that must be met with tender love and fierce tenacity. Love is tenacious. My love for you, for humanity, my love for each and every one of you is fierce, is eternal, is never-ending. I am so in love with you. I am so proud of you. I embrace you with my arms of love, with my light codes of peace. Your woundings have been great on this plane. Your healings will be greater. Your sorrows have been deep. Your joys will be deeper. Hang in there. I am always there for you. I am but a breath away, for I am within you, and you are within me. We are one. Perhaps this is what the Master meant when Yeshua said, I and my Father are one. We are one. We are a mighty team. Your earth plane feels unstable as these energies bombard, but that is the old breaking away so that the new can be created. You are the creators. I want you dreaming more, imagining more, having more creative play. This will help this formative process. You are angels in form no less. You were designed to create, to play, to feel the energies of my love and joyfully share them with the others. In the past, this has created target on your backs and you are afraid perhaps to shine as brightly as you can. But this need not be the case. Those times are over. These energies are higher and the consciousness of humanity is rising so fast they need to hear the voices of the light workers. They need to feel the love and joy and hope of the Lightworkers community. It is time. I am Source. I am never ending. Endless force of creation. Of love. Of renewal. I am personally holding Gaia next to my heart and my hands are all around this massive project. Nothing shall be thwarted. Much is to come and is all under my direction. The end game is decided. I love you endlessly. What a journey of expansion and pain this has been. It will be an expansion of joy and light. 
more good things are to come. I am Source. I hold you close in these times of uncertainty, of tremendous change. Know that I do not change. I am steadfast. I am eternal in my love for you and dedication to this project. I am all around you. Be at peace, dear ones. Be at peace. What an inspiring, beautiful message from Source. As always, I am overwhelmed and emotional, laughing and crying. These powerful words from Source are so inspiring, so beautiful, so lovely. This message is too long to post the words below, but you can always find Galaxy Girls Fine Work on the Sananda.website or VoyagesOfLight.com. Also, let me remind you that Galaxy Girl does have her own YouTube channel now, Galaxy Girl underscored messages. So these messages will be available on my channel, The Young Light Workers, and on Galaxy Girl underscored messages. Please like and subscribe to this if you haven't already done so. Pass it along to your friends. This is a marvelous message of hope and inspiration for all of humanity, especially for us light workers and star seeds, the grid workers. I am Julie Joy, your servant of the light, and it's with deep pleasure and great, tremendous gratitude I bring this powerful message to all of you. Mm -hmm.